Hi everyone, this is Healy Master Healer coming to you guys with a quick reading and um, um, psychic reading. And Chris North, um, AK Mr. Big, um, you guys see right now um, what's happening to um, Mr. Big right now in, in the media. You see that um, a lot of allegations been coming out of him. Um, you know, people are saying all kind of stuff about the man right now. So I hope that um, some of it is not true. But um, first of all, I would say straight up um, what I'm seeing spiritually um, and, uh, and as a reader or seer, um, definitely uh, what I'm seeing here, some of the allegations are true, not all, some. Um, you guys have to understand Mr. Big is a Scorpio. And you understand, you have to understand the dark side of Scorpio men. Now, Mr. Big have a side that a lot of people do not know about. You know what I'm saying? Including his wife. And um, I see more problems from again. Um, definitely his career is over. I see that his career is over. And um, I don't see him coming back from this right now. And look out for more people gonna come out with more stuff. I see that, um, I see allegations of cheating. Um, um, somebody will come out, I see that somebody's gonna come out and say that he might have been um, cheating recently on his wife. I see those allegations, those are allegations. So um, so look out for that. That's what I'm seeing spiritually, that um, that's gonna pop up. I see a lot of um, envy and jealousy. Um, his enemies come out for him. Also, too, is that um, the timing of all this, too, is about um, getting paid. What people don't understand, the laws have changed in California and um, New York. A lot of people could come with old, with old stuff, that, that allegations that they say that happened from back in the day, a couple of years ago. You know what I'm saying? And they could come back. And um, also, too, what I'm seeing quickly for, um, for Mr. Big, is a 50% chance that I see that he'll get charged and, and um, he can end up going to jail. I see that um, he 50% chance this man could get charged and, and will end up in jail. That's what I'm seeing. Also, I, I'm seeing um, the wife, um, Ms., um, Chris, um, Chris North wife, I see that she's, re she's sad, she's depressed. Um, this this re marriage is over. I'm gonna cut straight to the point. This marriage is over. Um, it's just a matter of time. And I see eventually she will pack up and move to Canada because if she stay in the States, the paparazzi say them will hung her down. You, you understand what I'm saying? They done start already, like all in LA. I don't know where they're living in LA or New York or wherever, but um, she's better off running back to uh, home, uh, um, to Canada, where she could get away from the paparazzi. Uh, I believe that she's originally from Canada, maybe Vancouver or something like that. Um, I have to say, um, this um, Chris North and his wife, they were a good match because um, when I look at it, she's Pisces and um, you know, he's Scorpio, so they were a good match, they, 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 um, they, they kind of suit each other, but they have a side of him that a lot of people didn't really know, so everybody's seeing this handsome looking man, um, real cool and stuff, but sometimes everybody have a good side and a dark side, you understand what I'm saying, no? just that sometimes we have to pay attention. So um, definitely one of the people that are, um, that is talking the truth a hundred percent, and I will say this is Beverly Johnson, um, and not because she's a black person that are saying that because I'm black, it's just that um, I have to call a spade a spade. You know, one thing with me I will say that, um, and that's the first I'm gonna go into this um, thing. The only the, the downside what I don't like is that um, people come in with cases that um, I think that we trying people in the media without even having any proof or anything like that. I want to see receipts, I want to see proof and things like that. Now, I don't want to see nobody coming with allegation. Doesn't matter who it is, you know what I mean? Because we all have sons, a lot of people out here, I have a lot of clients, they all have sons and stuff. I know some of you clients would like to see your son, somebody accusing your son of something that you, you believe that might not happen. And I think now we're setting up very, very, very dark president. You know, um, I'm not saying that I don't believe the, the woman and them. You know what I'm saying? I told you guys, I'm seeing that some allegations are true, not all. And also to some things is timing and monetary um, issues because of the laws change in California and New York. Where, um, you see Miss Bill Crosby, you see that um, somebody come, one of them ladies and come back and say that Bill Crosby allegedly had raped her or, or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Or years ago, I mean, maybe in the 70s or something like that. 
So, you know what I mean, is the laws. So some people um, coming out and using those monetary um, gains also to some of the allegations might be true in some of these cases, uh, not all. I'm not gonna say which one or anything like that. And you guys don't comment and ask me. Um, you know, I don't really put people business out there like that. But um, this is a sad situation. I see more losses from Mr. Big, he's done. Um, also too, I see him um, right now for him, this is like right now the mr big when i look at it right now he didn't expect this to be like this he knew it was coming that's why you see they kill off his, his character um so early um in the um any show that he was on because they know from the um the article i think in the magazine when the story break and it, it, it went viral like wildfire they, they, a lot of people know it was coming even mr big he knew it was coming is that he thought that it, it, um, he didn't thought it would have come like this this hard now so when i look at him right now spiritually he's very surprised um this thing hit him like a ton of bricks um he's he's in denial about certain things i see certain things that he's looking like he's looking all confused he feel like he's in a prison and definitely i see prison around him he have to be careful i hope that he have the best lawyer I know his, his father used to be, um, I know his father was a big lawyer um, um, there, uh, and, you know, I mean, his mom was in media, I think his mom had passed away years ago, and a very pretty lady, um, so, Mr. Big, um, I hope that he get the best lawyer, the best team, and, and stuff, because to fight this, because if he do not fight it, and, and fight it head on, I see um, that he can end up in jail, I totally got a 50% chance, that's what I'm seeing, um, the, and again, um the wife is going to ride it out she's not going to leave just yet but definitely um i see that the marriage is done uh, um definitely it had little problems little cracks in, in the marriage before before this happened but i think this take it over the, the hump it have some things the wife know but she's not going to say anything because um she's not going to use that because at the end of the day that's a um i mean that's a um husband and father everything like that so it has something she does not want to say but she's you could see that um she's very embarrassed she's ashamed um she wasn't expecting something like this both of them wasn't expecting something like this they thought um something would have been like one woman come out and it might have blow over but um also we have to watch out um for mr big um because right now this man is losing everything we have to um they need to pay attention to him because I see that um, he will want to, to, to do something um, to himself. You know what I'm saying? No? So um, if if he's alone by himself and um, if he start drinking, he have to be careful um, if he drinking and stuff. Because sometimes people might start drinking and might want to drink, try to drink away the problem. But um, it's, a, it's just a sad situation. Sad situation for the ladies and stuff. Sad, sad situation for, for, um, for um, Chris North's wife. Um, I'm not worried about Mr. Big, uh, as I say. Um, I see some karma come back to bite him. As I say, guys, I don't tell anybody anything. Anything that we do, um, as I always say, anything you do in the dark, just come to light one day. Whether it takes 10 years, 5 years, 20 years, a lot of things, a lot of people thought they would get away with. Even Bill Cosby, he thought that he would get away with a lot of stuff. You know what I'm saying? No? Um, even he and all had to pay the price also too. So um, anything we do, anything we do, bad in this world, if it is 10 years, 20 years, five years, it, it, it will come back. I believe in that. And, and, and we see it our own twice. It comes back. So we, we, we can jump high, jump low. Everybody gonna pay the price. It pays to, to do right by people in this world because you never know where you might end up. The same person that you do bad now, might, you might end up um, and face that same person at some point in time in, in, in the near future. So definitely um, not a good look um, for, for, for Chris North, Mr. AK, Mr. Big. Um, it, it's just a sad situation. I feel bad for some of these women and stuff. Um, I see that finally Beverly Johnson, a lot of people are um, talking about Beverly Johnson, say, but how come? It, um, something happened with her with, um, with Bill Crosby that um, she, she came out and with allegations saying that Bill Crosby had, had drugged her and all that stuff. 
But um, the woman been consistent. When you look at Beverly Johnson, she been consistent. Before even the Me Too movement, and then she been telling people like um, about this. But because she black, nobody doesn't really believe us because some of us, you have some um, black females lied on certain people and they make it bad for some people who really actually um, get assaulted or, or, or something like that. You know, the honest people are being trash, you know, the people that who really went through something. So we have to give Beverly Johnson credit because she did it. She came out years ago. She came out, she told every, she, she was telling everybody, but because she black, nobody doesn't want to believe her. You know what I'm saying? Huh? So the same thing like when a young minority lady, anything happened and she go um, to the precinct or she go to one of these, um, and she go to the police, the police and them is trying to convince them, you sure you get raped? You sure this happened? You sure this happened? They always try to, um, they, 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 they make it difficult for the person. You know what I'm saying? Huh? While now if it's somebody else, man, they say, yeah, go get a rape kid. So, so it, 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 it's, it, it's always going to be a double standard. You know what I'm saying? It's always a double standard and, and always with, with us, some of us, um, it, it, it's tough. You know, you know what I'm saying? You know? Especially um, some of us who have daughters and stuff and young kids, you have to guard your children. You, know? you can't have your children out there. You know what I'm saying? You have sick people in this world, you know? And um, yeah, who I feel sorry for, I feel bad for, um, for Beverly Johnson. Now she had to relive this whole, this whole or ordeal come up in, in the spotlight and they're trying to draw her into this um, I'm glad that she, she, she decided to do like a restraining order in case or anything because you know they'll try to trash her um, and stuff but she's not really studying the money or anything like that but it's just a sad situation I feel sorry for Chris North's wife and, and his kids um, that's what I feel sorry for not for him but um, I feel sorry for the ladies and them that um, say that things happen to them so more power to them. I hope that um, justice prevail for them, and I hope that um, everything work out um, in in their favor. You know, so definitely this is it for um, for Chris North, um, aka Mr. Big. So a quick recap: um, his wife, I see that she's going to leave at some point in time, just a matter of time. Um, sometime in 2022, it will happen, and um, it might happen sooner than we think. But um, it's definitely a wrap. But um, people need to pay their eyes, watch him, because I, I see um, I see he's Mr. Big will be heading like in a dark place. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? No? So um, so definitely um, we can hang more for me. So click um, don't forget to like, subscribe. Thank you for the subscribers. Happy holidays to you guys. Happy New Year, everything. I wish you guys all the best. And thank you guys, every each one of all you for supporting me for 2021. I'm looking forward to 2022 to, um, to bring you some lovely teaching videos to educate some of you guys. Um, things things will be happening. Things will be coming. At least um, you guys will be getting videos at least um, three times a week, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. It have sometimes I will drop um, five videos. Um, I will drop a, a video every day, Monday to Friday. But minimum, you guys, um, starting from 2022, you'll be getting um, at least three videos a week. That's it. Um, no more request videos. I, I don't have the time to be doing no request videos. Um, if you guys requesting something, I will try to put it in a monthly blog, the celebrity blog. I will put it in. I have some things I'm not going to be putting because, as I say, a lot of people have been jacking some of my readings. Um, some of the bloggers and stuff, these content um, stealers, I don't call them creators, they're stealers. And um, as I say, I'm going to deal with them in the right time, you know. As I say, you know, I, I ain't threatening nobody. I will deal with them. I not, I not, I not have time to study them. People go always steal. As long as you're on social media, people are going to jack your stuff. People are going to try to steal. There's nothing much you can do. But um, you guys.